The Buena Vista golf course has faced several challenges just to remain open. And a few days ago, a new one erupted. I'm Raquel Callo, your neighborhood reporter on the west side, and a fire in their maintenance yard destroyed nearly a dozen pieces of their equipment. We came out and by that time it was pretty well engulfed and took out uh, hundreds of thousands of dollars of equipment. I visited Buena Vista Golf Course to meet Chad Sorensen, the owner and manager. While the course itself looked pristine with golfers spread out across the green grass, the maintenance yard was filled with charred debris. Chad told me he believed the fire started from one of the motors. KCFD hasn't determined the exact cause yet. He also mentioned the fire was so intense that this blob of aluminum used to be a radiator. This was a fairway unit, which is no longer. And then I've got three, three large rough units that went down. I have uh, three utility vehicles, two tow behind rough units that went down. Uh, right behind you, there's a greens mower that's half melted. Chad said that the burned units were once used daily, but now he and the crew at the course are working hard to salvage whatever they can and find replacements. Burned every single tire. All the hoses are pretty much toast. Engines are fried. However, he says he's grateful that the fire didn't reach any buildings, people, or the golf course itself. Things run its course, and if we can get some relief from the county, we will. If, if we can, you know, have an act of God where we only get a rainstorm here every day, then that would be great, too. Due to the required equipments being out of state, officials tell me it'll take about two years to recover and acquire new equipment. For 23ABC, I'm your neighborhood reporter, Raquel Callow.